So when I was looking for the content I didn't get to upload last year, I came across an old student film I was in, The Day You Died. Now, this isn't a new thing, and I originally didn't upload it because I was embarrassed by it. But when I decided to share it with some friends, we all couldn't help but laugh at the stupidity of it, and I thought, you know what? Screw it! I'm gonna upload this for the lols! Now, I got permission to upload the movie itself in its entirety ages ago, from the director themselves, after we wrapped, and from all the actors involved. What I would like to inform people of, though, is that this is a student film made by some of the sweetest people I've ever worked with, especially this woman here. Those cookies there were some of the goodies she made for us all to eat on set throughout production. The director and most of the crew were students who came to Australia to study film and basically get some more practical work done. So that explains why some of the dialogue is janky or if it feels like a beginner's project. Most of them couldn't speak fluent English. Me and my older mate here, he normally does uh, stage performances, but he's also a good film actor. We tried our best to fix the dialogue and make it better for an English audience because they told us that they wanted it for an English audience. This was also an unpaid gig, so we're just kind of doing this out of the goodness of our hearts, and it's just for a bit of fun. If you're wondering why I was so persistent on tweaking the original script, here's just a small excerpt before we ended up messing around with it. Tom. What's fuck off? Tom. Yeah, I've got someone 100% reliable. But they are very experienced. Are you sure? Just do what I have told you, mate! I will pay him $1,000 deposit. When it is succeeded, I will give him another $50,000. Now, with all that said, they treated us very well and even ended up slipping us some gas money and made sure to take care of us till the very end. So even though we're going to laugh at this and rip it apart, all that jazz, please note that we're making fun of the movie and not these wonderful, beautiful people. I'm joined with my movie buff mate here as we watch the film together. But if you want to see the film itself without commentary, feel free to check the link in the description or just check out my channel and look for The Day You Died film. All credits goes to everyone involved and they're at the end of the video. Thanks, peeps! And thank you, patrons. Winky face. Ready, yeah, whenever you you're ready, do, do a countdown. Yeah, yeah, you can do a countdown if you want. You normally do Three, it. Three, two, one, cringe. Well, two minutes ago, I think I would have been a fortunate man. But now I'm dead on the balcony of my grandpa's house. And I fucking hate that voice. It all started with a phone call. What the fuck? Is that even your voice? It is my voice, yeah. They wanted a very calm voice. It's a very calm I just it just wound up being very Trust me. What? Wait, 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 don't hang up. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, sometimes it's because like the audio mixing is like like the audio mixing is bad or something. Oh, it was a lot of things. The script itself was terrible. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I love my, I love my son. Well, I'll give it, it was... this. The camera quality is actually. Wait. Good. Yes, the camera quality was good. They got like university equipment, so you'd expect it to be good. That was actually a fairly decent camera movement right there. Yes. Turn around and go back in your house. Quickly! Got it I on. feel like... Oh, yeah, the sound quality is kind of bad. I feel like they should have zoomed in on his face, not the gun, but that's that's me. Shit! But see the line? Oh, Shit! Dude. Fuck up! Yeah, it's like you didn't have to say that, that you fucked up. Fucking People man. don't say fuck up when they don't, fuck something don't up. Don't kill me! They just say shit. Take or damn. Whatever you mm. want. Shut up. Th this isn't them though. This is the dialogue that they wrote. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's written by the director, and, right? Yeah, and we, me, and that older fellow there, we tried to fix what it. This one. But it, we're trying to salvage uh, questionable, qu questionable script oh, writing. I know you're at home. I bring some cookie for you. She is so adorable. She yeah, really did bring cookies for everyone. Yeah, I remember you told me that. That's very sweet of her. Yeah, she's so, she's so nice and adorable.
It's my favorite scene. John, are you okay? Can you be quiet? Get the fuck out of here! Your cookies and cake taste like shit. I hate them. How can she hear them? Don't bother it me. And don't look for Chris again. The music doesn't match the tone like of this you. fucking scene. Get out of I here! I know. Felt good to get that off my chest. <laughs> he like. It just comes from nowhere, and it's like, oh, am I doing this to, like, save you? Or do I just genuinely fucking hate you? I can't tell. Yeah, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Keep loaded. Keep loaded. I understand why the subtitles you got it. Where do you think you're going? Please, not good don't kill me. Please. Oh, yeah, you need him. I don't know why there's such a big space in the... Yeah. I don't know if that's normal, but... Don't kill me! Oh yeah, did you tell me they did this because the audio was like really bad that day, or like the mics weren't working? If I'm correct, yeah, I think it was actually, because we're outside, and it was capturing a lot of the birds and all that jazz. I mean, I'm okay with... That? That's being resourceful. That adds more it's just, realism it's to just, it, honestly. Yeah, it's, it's just the script itself, I think. No, that's mine. Yeah. That's the watch I put in the cupboard today. Why did you do it? Because my mother is sick, and I need money for the hospital bill. I remember you told me last year your mother died. Tell me the truth. I was wrong. My brother. This is my brother. Tell me the truth. I just want to buy a bag. Just a bag? Oh, wow, mister. Ooh. Wow. That was the most realistic gunshot I've ever seen. Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm okay with... I was okay with the gunshot. It was mostly other little I things, like no the glass I shattering and all no that. muzzle fire. I didn't see the gas escaping from the weapon itself. I didn't see the window shatter. That's Tom, an insurance agent. Mm. And my friend. He, he, he went for the jigsaw twist. The twist that we don't even understand because we weren't introduced to these characters until now! Persuade okay. my grandpa into buying life insurance. And who is the beneficiary? Well, of course it's me. Grandfather, don't hesitate. Sign. Sign! Okay. Yeah! I'm gonna get two million dollars! <laughs> Good chance! <laughs> what are we gonna do next? I hate this dialogue! Kit man. I know you've got someone. And then when it's done, I'll give you fifty thousand dollars. Yeah. I like the perfect how plan. In the fucking frame. <laughs> yeah, the they were so persistent. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's the point? They were yeah. so... They were so persistent on the fucking dialogue. Find a hatchet man! The fuck's a hatchet man?! I think it's a... Get a hit man! Yeah, I think it's what? a for a hit man. Yeah. It probably is, but like, no one's gonna understand. They wanted it to be for an English audience. That's yeah. not for a fucking English audience. Yeah, it sounds something like people in China would say to refer to a hit man. Usually, yeah. like, what? What would what would an Australian what would an Aussie say when he wants to refer refer you to a uh, to an assassin or hitman? Just get me a hitman or find someone that you know. It's, it's find just find me someone who can fucking kill a bitch. Just <laughs> fucking kill a cunt. <laughs> just fucking <laughs> fuck around. Just mate, do it. Just, just fucking do it. A mate that can kill a bitch. Yeah! <laughs> I can fucking kill a bitch, mate! <laughs> we don't fuck around, but... Anyway... Yeah, there you go. There you go. That's like the second time I've shown you. Yes, what it was. Is. So what, what would you rate it out of 10? I'm not well, going to question you on the... Uh. Honestly, I've noticed a few things, like two things that I kind of like. That I kind of commend the director for. Um, but just the script is not one of them, that's for sure. Neither oh, well, is yeah. Yeah, um, that, that, the, the script, as mentioned, we had to literally rewrite, pretty much. 
Yeah, that's like, that was me and the other guy. Yeah, uh, I command uh, that one shot, that sweeping shot, when the nanny, you know, goes to get, like, her car keys or whatever the fuck before answering the door. I thought yeah. that was a fairly decently well done uh, sweep. It's not a perfect sweep, but it's a decent one. I thought that mm -hmm. was okay. Um, mm -hmm. Your acting's not bad. And, Why, thank um, you. The acting's not bad. And I think the older gentleman, um, I think he did his best, but I don't blame him. Some of the delivery was off. It just didn't match the tone of his scenes. But I don't blame him. I just think, I just blame the director for not knowing, you know, what to do. Not knowing how to yeah. do that actors. Yeah, because I, because as you know, I normally do voiceover and film, which I think shows, in my opinion, because I think my voiceover is better than my film. Um, I try to make what I had work. The older gentleman, um, he is, he has a stage, like on stage drama performance background. He's, he, he works with a lot of, uh, stage actors and all that. And he, he's helped, uh, conduct and, and helped perform and, and, you know, set up, uh, plays and all that. So that's his area. So when he saw the script, that's how he took it. He's like, all right, this is not supposed to be taken seriously. This is just supposed to be fucking grandiose and just sort of over the top. And so that's yeah. how he took it. And I don't blame him for that because you see his fucking lines? Yeah. So, but it just doesn't match. Like, our characters don't match with one another and with what the script's trying to do. Um, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah he strikes he strikes me as a guy who has experience in him. Yeah, I was right. Um, but yeah, yeah, overall, uh, I would give it a, um, I don't know, two or three out of ten. I don't think it's a total piece of shit. Uh, actually, I just remember the random fucking, like, title card with dialogue. Yeah. I, I was like, no, nah, they should have just recorded your audio with the birds, you know, chirping in the background. It would have added more realism to it. I think they strike me yeah. as people that were too lazy to do audio mixing because audio mixing is pretty um, difficult. But you yeah, know, if you if you're gonna make a movie, you know, go all the way, or don't make a movie at all. <laughs> I agree. Yeah, I mean, I, I think you should use what you can, even if you don't got good so But even when they were recording me doing the audio. Like, they had me do it. I don't remember how many times, but they had me do it m more than, like, twice, I think. And mm -hmm. and I was even telling them, I think, like, look, if you want, I could edit this for you. Like, you know, like... Because I think they just wanted it to be solid. One solid take. No edits. And I think that's why, like, it felt very strange. Like, and... That, that is yeah, way and so too ambitious for college students. <laughs> Yeah. Way yeah. too ambitious. Like, I can I mean, tell so, they're passionate, but that's too mm. ambitious for them. I mean, some of the shorter lines, like, fucking sign, sign! Like, that was... <laughs> obviously, that was separate, but my God. I hey, did it hey, normally. Yeah. I did it normally, like, at, at first. Like, swear, I swear to God, you know, I was like, sign. Sign it. You know, like, you know, like, just more, like, genuine, you know, just, like, just mild. But no, they wanted, like, sign! Sign! It's yeah. like, yeah, I'm going to get $2 million or whatever the fuck. I'm like, oh, like, my God. They should have been mm. more. It's like they it's didn't not even... care. It's like it was a mixture, a messy mixture yeah. of different tones. And as you said as well, you don't, you show, you don't tell. You know, yeah. like, oh, yeah, I'm going to get all this money because I'm greedy. I'm the evil character. That's me. I hate that. That's the worst sin you can commit as a screenwriter because that just shows that you're, you're condescending your audiences when you're just, you know, telling everything rather than, yeah. you know, showing it and let your audience connect the dots on their own. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's fucking bad. bad. Yeah, the script is definitely the worst part of this <laughs> six minute short film yes without a doubt but yeah um anyway. my verdict is pretty much two out of ten what about you mine is um a box full of cookies out of ten because the director was nice and the, the everyone else was nice and and the cute woman with the cookies was the sweetest and she made sure that we were nice everyone everyone on set was very nice it's just the script itself was bad 
So I, I name guy, it a box full of cookies know. out of ten. Give it a and box. And the guy doesn't know how to direct, <laughs> obviously. Uh, it was a woman. It was, it was a, uh, a woman director. You didn't see oh. her in the film. It, you oh, didn't okay. see her in the film, but uh, yeah, uh, the, the, the direct. Yeah, unfortunately, she All just right, wasn't. Well, she, she was clearly in training. She's clearly just making something, you know. So whatever, okay. but like. Well. Yeah. Uh, you anyway. Know, this is probably her first video. It felt like her first film she's ever done, and um, I uh, commend. I her think for it was, or, or one of her first. Yeah, I don't commend her directing skills, but I do commend her for actually, you know, trying for actually making yes. a film. Yes, of yeah. course, of course. I commend her for that. We're not shitting. We're not shitting on the director. We're just no. shitting on like we're 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 not even really shitting on. We're just having a having a laugh. It's funny, you know. Like, no offense, you know, it's just fine. It's just fucking around. I hope she continues and she, yes. and she you know, practices her craft of directing and, um, and improves herself. Yes, if you want to look anyone up, they're in the credits. So, and if you want to watch the video uh, just in its normal sense, I'll probably upload it later or attach it to this video if you want more cringe. <laughs> and yeah, now we're actually going to go do something worth our time. So, <laughs> cool. <laughs> All right. Aside from the fact that we were playing Crackdown 3 just a second ago. What do you think of Fuck Crackdown that. 3? It's the biggest pile of fucking shit that ever grazed my fucking eyeballs recently. <laughs> I absolutely fucking hate it. Beautiful. Five years, three fucking delays, and we got this unfinished pile of fucking shit. I of absolutely course. fucking hate it. Like, fucking Cyberpunk... It's finished compared to this fucking game. <laughs> yeah, it's finished, ready to go. Yeah, All right. No. All right. Cool. Sweet. We're done. Any last words? Um, I don't know. Um, be safe. Wear a mask. Don't be an asshole. You mean don't be an asshole? Don't be. Don't be an asshole. Oh, okay. You lying sack of shit. Okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs>